Welcome to this quick tutorial in which we hope to provide clarification on what Citrix is and how it functions. When a student comes to LCS with their laptop or tablet, we want them to be fully prepared for class with the Microsoft Essentials, even if they don't have Microsoft Office loaded on their computer. In order to meet this expectation, we have provided individualized accounts for all of our students to access our Citrix receiver. Through the Citrix receiver, our students are able to access all of the Microsoft Essentials and any other application which we publish to them. So think of Citrix in this way. Imagine that the computer in the center of this image represents Citrix. The students represented on the periphery of the image are able to use their computers to simultaneously access Citrix, just as if they were all gaining access to another person's computer. In this way, all of the students are able to simultaneously utilize the resources of the central computer as if it was their own. So here's where it can get a little confusing. When you're using Citrix, you aren't using programs that are loaded on your computer. You're using your computer to access another computer, which has the programs you require. Later, if you want to access those files, you'll need to access them through Citrix, just like you did when you first created the file. The Microsoft Word, Excel, or PowerPoint files you create in Citrix will only be accessible to you through Citrix. Those files are not stored on your local computer. In a later tutorial, we'll address how to find and access files created in Citrix, as well as how to upload assignments to your teacher that you have created in Citrix. Thanks for your attention.